Uh, uh, briefly, I, I um, uh, dream. Uh, uh, whenever I hear that word dream, I always go back to, to, to uh, Martin, Luther, Martin Luther King. Uh, and I always remember that he, be, he began with his, he, he actually began with the identity of his nation. Uh, all, all men, forgive me, created equal. Uh, he began with the Declaration of Ind Independence. Uh, so I, I and, and then he went on to, with an audacious use of the imagination. I dream of the time that I can, that, 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 my, that, that my children will play with. Uh, um, white white children in these various states that were of course uh, not conducive to that. Uh, uh, that was a wonderful example of of, of uh, 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 dreaming. And as Yeats, W. B. Yeats, in 1916, in a book called Responsibilities, he said, um, uh, uh, um, "In dreams begin responsibility." Now, once you see the possibilities emerging, then you want to take responsibility for them. So, uh, I, I, my, my dream is, I hope, I just hope that we can begin to take responsibility. And in particular, uh, my dream is that we can uh, we can develop that within education. Uh, that's where it has to be. Uh, ed ed education, schools, universities, um, the dynamic in many situations is that, is that they do not enable agency, uh, they enable conformity, um, they do not enable uh, accountability uh, and mutual accountability, um, uh, they enable uh, do, being, being, do as, I, uh, as I'm told, uh, and they do not therefore enable creativity, uh, uh, responsibility and the, and the, and the related uh, moral, psychological and intellectual virtues need to be at the heart of our educational experience. Um, uh, I would start there. I don't want to change the world. Uh, the, the world is much too big, but I think you can change education.